Co-op, bitch, bitch, bitch. Page 57, it's the last, it's the last par paragraph on page. It said, one day a recording engineer by the name of Caveman heard and liked Metro stuff enough to pass it to OJ the Juice Man. So if you didn't know yet, OJ the Juice Man and Caveman found Metro booming. So you really have to think about this. You have to think about this. Without OJ the Juice Man, where would, they, where would Waka Flocka be? Without OJ the Juice Man, where would Future be? Where would Future be without OJ the Juice Man? Cause that who that who found him, and then people don't even you know people don't even talk about his first Metro very first placement ever, very first placement, four from Alley Boy, he did four, very first oh, very four. first placement Nigga, that shit was hard. That was the shit with Jeezy and Gotti, right? Very first placement Nigga, got Jeezy and Gotti. Hard. At the time he was signing Don Cannon. Metro was. <laughs> yeah. I had to I was I I had took I took Metro to Don Cannon and I said, Listen, I got him a real placement, bro. We got Yo Gotti and Jeezy yeah, on that it. Shit was hard. I need your help. I don't know what to do. So Don signed him and he he administered, you know, all that yeah. for shout out to Cookies and Milk. They helped me with all the Cookies paperwork. Cookies and milk. Amy yeah. and Kiki. Yep. Yeah. I don't know what they're doing right now, but they shout took out care of me. We were just talking about that. Yeah, yeah, you know, they helped me with all the paperwork on that side. Yeah. And the contract was only for like a year. Mm -hmm. When the year went over, I had that can like, what, what we finna do, man? The young nigga, you know, he, he about to blow up. And he was like, I'm finna release this nigga. He ain't got no place, but he only got one. Let him go. Whew. Six months later, no, nah, six months later, Future put out Hard, which was the very first record that Metro and Future did was called Hard. And uh, Future called Metro, you know, called Metro to the studio, and they, they called me, and they really was like, man, listen, we wanna sign him. I was hear me about that. Like, what do I do? These niggas are trying to take my nigga. And I, no, uh, when, when I read the contract, I was like, listen, man, you signed the contract. It's another, uh, another boy is me. Like, I ain't got no job because they're going to appoint you a new manager. They're going to point you everything. She ain't got nothing to do with me. So, Future just came at me. He was like, yo, what you want to get him out of your contract? And at the time, I was young. I didn't really understand what was going on. So, I was like, man, shoot me five bands. You can have them because this contract is fucked up. If he chooses to sign this, I don't want nothing to do with this shit right, right. here. This contract is boo boo fool, and so um, future went in the pocket and give me five thousand, and the rest is history. Yeah, and, and then and then, and then uh, Karate Shop came out two weeks later. Co-op, co bitch, co bitch. Co